you stay here. Thank you today. This is a beautiful space surrounded by gorgeous artwork. Thank you so much. Welcome. Thank you. So I understand that you recently com completed a few new pieces. Um, can you tell us a little bit about these pieces? Yes, well, when I first made contact with you about a year and a half, I, I was showing this, I call this the Color Therapy Series. I did part one of the Color Therapy Series down in San Rafael at um, the, the fencing company. And it was part of the, uh, the Art Walk, uh, Marine Art Walk. Right. And um, so that part one was done for that. And then I completed these three, this triptych for this interview specifically. So um, this series is actually larger and there's more colors. Um, I've incorporated some browns and um, blacks and golds and burgundies and um, it's the same idea. It's sort of just um, an exploration of, of color and color's effect on mood and um, how color can affect people and how it feels to be around different colors and different combinations of colors. And, um, and it's also an experiment in, experimentation in size because, my, like I said, my, my other ones were smaller and now these are going on larger scales. So I can ask the viewer, ask myself, what happens when these paintings go larger? Mm -hmm. How does that affect the mood? How does the color affect the mood? So yes, these are these are new works, and we're really happy to have you here. Come visit hey, the gallery. Thank you. Well, I love the new works. The colors really pop. Thank and, you. And um, I was just wondering, um, how long has the gallery been around? We opened in May of this year, 2013, May of 2013. So four or five months. Great. And um, when did you start creating art? I've only been an artist about six years, so. I just sort of dove in head first and uh, just sort of been going going at it full time for six about six years. Great. And um, what inspired you to become an artist? <clears throat> um, I just uh, sort of got the idea, and it, the idea sort of grew over time. And I decided one day I think I want to start painting. You know, not so much be an artist, quote unquote, but just start painting. Um, just playing with paint and painting, and it's about it was more about being around color, it's sort of along these same lines. What what does color do? How can color affect you? Um, you know, big abstract splashing around with paint. I got the idea, and the idea grew, um, and it was more about wanting to be around color and splash around with color and paint than than it was more to be in quote unquote, to become an artist. I see. So the, the idea was to paint, but not necessarily become an artist, but over time I suppose I am becoming an artist. And how would you describe your artistic genre? Would you say it's very abstract? I would say um, these, these would definitely be abstract expressionism. Um, I have a couple of other styles. Um, mostly I pursue an bright, splashy, fun, colorful, um, abstract florals. These are very abstract. Some of my florals are a little bit more liberal, where you can actually see that this is a flower taking shape. Mm -hmm. um, so some are more abstract and some are more literal. And then I do this other series, um, kind of a spray paint. I do like to play around with spray paint. And um, I've done a series of American flags using you know, taping off and spray painting on plywood, and um, I've also doing my Good Dog series. And I also uh, fiddle around with doodling and drawing and um, works on paper, too. All sounds very cool. Well, thank you. So, um, do your paintings carry a lot of symbolism, and what are you trying to convey through your art? I think it's more of just an expression, um, just expressing myself on paper, expressing myself on canvas, more so just pure expression than trying to get a message out. Um, I think the message is color and the message is symmetry of form and, and harmony of shape and just trying to come to um, a result that um, brings joy and something that people find joyful. 